About an hour and a half ago, leaders in Santee broke ground on a brand new water treatment facility. And they also launched the East County Advanced Water Purification Program. CBS 8's Chris Grow live in Santee with more details. And Chris, state of art, the art technology that's going to be used to purify this recycled water, right? Exactly. And because we all know how valuable water is, and that's why they don't want to let even one drop go to waste. They want to make sure that water is not only able to be recycled, but also then treated and made drinkable. So let's show you that groundbreaking ceremony that took place again just about an hour and a half ago. And this East County Advanced Water Purification Program will likely be completed, all of the infrastructure that's needed for this, by about 2026. That is the estimate right now. Now, once completed, it promises to fulfill, get this, 30% of East County water supply needs. That's 11.5 million gallons of drinking water a day for more than 500,000 or more residents out here in the East County. Now we spoke with Alan Carlisle with the Padre Dam Municipal Water District. He told us a little bit more about the process, how the water is treated, how it is that it becomes drinkable, and that was all shortly before today's ceremony. So take a listen to what he had to say. The water that will be uh, cleaned and produced here will uh, travel 11 miles over to Lake Jennings. It will be blended there with a raw water supply and then treated again at the Levy treatment plant and then distrib distributed to uh, half a million population in East County. So again, 2026 is the estimate about when it will be completed, but all invested in this, we're hearing uh, it's the county of San Diego, where city of El Cajon, Padre Municipal Dam, as well as the Helix Water District. Eric and Dana Marie.